right, man. Listen, I'm not going to do this the way I normally do it. Because there is so much to talk about when it comes to this shoe. So, in this box is the Big Baller brand Z02 2019. I ordered this back in January uh, 19, 2019. Multiple emails has been sent back and forth. Um, in fact, I'll actually post the email, the email exchanges right after this whole uh, video. So I went to Nightwing's place earlier so I could see the samples that he was given. I asked his permission if I could actually borrow it. And uh, he, he said yes and... Uh, if you guys have seen his video, he is probably the only one who has this pair. And I have shown you a video of this shoe as well when I was playing. I think I was playing with him or I visited him um, when he was playing. I forgot. But here we are. Fast forward. Freaking, what, January 19th. Today's August 6th. Almost eight months eight months away and uh, let's see if this freaking shoe promises or gives us what it promises okay so I don't know if you guys want to see this so um, this is like a compensation for for the very much delayed uh, shoe delivery Let's let's you know what just just for your viewing pleasure. Let's just see what the f this is, man. Like so, this is a hoodie. It says Lonzo Ball. Come on, bro. Like, come on, man. Come on, bro. Like I'm. I don't know if I'm even gonna wear this. I I threw it on the side. All right, box. Big baller brand. That's supposed to be gold. I don't know, my light's not catching it or something. There you go. That's white and gold. Give me a second. Okay, there it is. So it is white and gold right there. It says big baller brand on one side. ZO2 symbol. Jello symbol. Mellow ball. Triple B. Nothing in the bottom. Again, Triple B, ZO2, Jello, um, Mellow. ZO2192, BBB, BK, LB. I don't know what the hell that is, but it's supposed to be the Madagascar colorway. Um, I don't know, man. I'm almost... I almost don't want to open this. Just because... I have seen a sample pair and I have seen Nightwing's Madagas Madagascar colorway as well. I am really, really hoping that my Madagascar colorway is more premium than his. <sighs> oh, damn it, man. Damn it. Damn it. Ah, damn, bro. No, I'm no, I am not happy. No, I am not happy, all right? God damn, bro. Fuck this. Fuck. Oh my god, man. Okay. All right, let me calm myself down. I am so freaking frustrated right now. I'm so freaking frustrated right now, man. <sighs> let me explain why, all right? Let me explain why. So Nightwing also has this, but when he showed me his, 
who's telling me why he thinks his pair is trash and even apologize to me ahead of time because I might get the same pair. Well, it is the same pair. This is trash. Okay, this this is trash. For something you pay 200 bucks. <sighs> oh my god, bro. I don't even know what to say, man. I am very okay. Uh there's a shoe tree I took it out. I just don't want to want you guys to think that uh I'm changing anything or some something like that. All right. God damn, bro. Whew. Okay. Differences and why I'm really pissed off right now. They advertise that everything on this shoe is supposed to be premium, right? After seeing Nightwing's video, you would think it'd come out premium like this. Well, you know what they say, bro. The devil is in the details, right? Okay, let's start off. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. Alright. Sample pair. Nightwing sample pair. Get the traction. This has been used already. Okay. Okay, same rubber. Same rubber content on the outsoles. But look at this. Subtle difference. This is all leveled. All right. Look at this one. What the hell is that, bro? Look at that. Look at the triple B. It's declining from the very first one down to here. Again, look at Nightwing sample pair. Look at the one I received. Okay. It's not... I can almost say it's even got the, a different texture to it. Okay, this is my pair. Not leveled. Nightwing's pair's texture. This has been used, mind you. Look. Alright. One difference spotted. When I fitted his uh, sample pair, the reason why I really wanted it was because of the very soft cushion. I even told him that. And this is also one part that he liked the most was also the cushion of the shoe. I'm not sure what type of cushion this was. I'm pretty sure he mentioned it on his video. So smooth, in fact. So soft. That he actually tore, tore up his right here. On the... On the... Mid... Uh, medial portion... Where there's a heel counter, or I'm sorry, heel counter, um, a midfoot shank. I'm just so pissed right now, man. I don't, can't even say what I really want to say. Alright, so, so soft, in fact, that it came to this. This is a little bit harder. Look at that, like, I'm, I'm even struggling. Well, this is not so hard, like, I may be exaggerating, exaggerating a little bit. But this is maybe three times harder than the sample pair. So take that with a grain of salt. However you want to understand that. But yeah. So it is a little bit harder. And uh, the reason, I would say one of the reasons why the production of this one was also delayed was because they actually take Nightwing's consideration. Um, brand Black, uh, Triple B, whatever you guys want to call it, but it's Brand Black. Uh, they take Nightwing's consideration when he says, like, this one is too soft, and that's why they change it. I'm not solely uh, blaming it on him. It's on the companies. 
fault, obviously. He just gave, gave him his feedback. All right. Next. Suede. Suede material right here. Very premium. Not, 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 your, not your cheap suede, but very premium. And that's the reason why it gives out this effect. That used effect because it's really premium, right? Now, although this is not supposed to be suede, instead of that premium suede, you are given a synthetic leather. Hoping this was going to be premium leather, you got synthetic leather instead. $200 shoe, synthetic leather. Again, $200 shoe, not genuine leather, synthetic leather. Okay? Suede portion right here, or premium suede portion supposed to be up on this side. Now I have to admit this is this leather right here is softer is softer than the toe box but I'm pretty sure this is still synthetic. Yeah, that's still synthetic, man. So again, $200 shoe, not genuine synthetic leather. Genuine leather, okay? Like even from the feel alone. Even from the folds, as you can see. I don't know. I, it's even got, because it's genuine leather, it almost feels like suede -ish. But you feel the leather, but suede -ish in texture. So this is how that feels. You know, when it's synthetic leather, when it's... When your finger doesn't run smooth, it's a little bit slippery, and you do not feel that suede -ish feel. So again, $200 shoe, synthetic leather. One, one other difference. Let's see. medial portion of the shoe with the strap supposed to be one piece where this has only been stitched right here compared to the sample pair which is actually its own it's just one right here it's all connected as you can see that's the sample pair this cheap ass put on just stitch over strap so when you when you're trying to get the support you're not even getting the support all around from your medial side you're just getting it right from starting from right here to here that's gonna be where your support is for the damn strap right okay moving a freaking long bro god damn man I'm I almost do not want to do this Laces. Oh my goodness. If you've played long enough, you know these laces hold up. Right? Even, even if you don't tie them correctly or tie them loosely, this is not going to loosen up and unlace. Rope laces, on the other hand, like I said, if you guys have been playing long enough, you know... This loosens up very easily. Now again, again, this is what was advertised though, so I can't really hate on that. The other two colorways have this type of lacing. Moving forward. Let's get the other pair that I took the shoe tree out. 
Let me see. The mesh almost the mesh and the lining almost feels the same. Medial mesh feels the same. Where are we at? Okay. This must be the biggest stupidest portion of the shoe. I even pulled up from StockX just to make sure I'm not tripping. See this back panel right here? You can see that mark right there. Any of you who have been in the shoe, uh, any of you who has been around shoes a lot, even from before, you guys know this symbol. This, this means genuine leather symbol. So this is genuine leather, right? On StockX, you can find the Madagascar colorway. Look at this portion right here. It's supposed to be, or it's supposed to have that genuine leather symbol. This was supposed to be leather. Correct me if I'm wrong. Go check StockX right now. And type Z0219. Madagascar. See if I'm lying. But instead of genuine leather, you freaking get cheap as felt, bro. Like 200 bucks. You give me felt. All right. If I was in the Philippines, I could buy this material in National Bookstore right now. Felt paper. That, that's this material right now 200 bucks felt felt synthetic leather synthetic leather synthetic leather stupid ass lacing to top it all off you have the nerve to write down inside the shoe tag you get that. I know if you guys can see, but if I can't get this right, I'll take a picture of it. Genuine leather upper balance. Bro. Bro, point to me around this shoe, around this colorway, which one is genuine leather. On your own product. You put a lie right on the freaking tag of your own product. How stupid can you get? How stupid can you get, man? I'm sorry. I'm just really pissed off right now. I paid 210 after taxes. I've waited eight months for this to arrive. And I get this trash? If you're not mad about that, then you are stupid, man. I'm freaking mad at this. I'm. This shoe, I could probably just get this with these materials for maybe even less than a hundred bucks. All right? This, this real talk. The reason why. I was tempted or even wanted to get a Z02 was because of this shoe. Okay? Genuine leather. I even, I don't know if you guys read my post about this, but I told you guys I don't want the midsole change because one of the main reasons why I really wanted the Z02s was because of the damn midsole, because of how soft it was. And now you change it to this harder one. Yes, I know I run the risk of having this happen to me, but I didn't care because I just wanted a soft midsole when I tried these ones on. Again, I wanted it because the midsole, the genuine leather all around, and just the premium materials of the shoes. 
But instead, you give me this. After eight months of freaking waiting. Synthetic leather. Stupid ass felt material. And the lie and the slap to my face. Says, one more time, I'm going to read it to you guys. Gen God damn it. I'm already hella pissed, bro. Ah, oh, my God. Genuine leather. Genuine leather upper balance. Synthetic leather. Felt and a lie right to my face. That's what I got. Eight months of waiting. Tell me what you guys think. I'm not even going to ask you if this is a cop or a drop because you are going to say this is a drop. Comment down below what your thoughts are. I'd, I would like to hear from you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for your support. Um, if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, that's where I keep it updated 24-7. Again... If you guys want to support the channel, hit that like button. It really does help the channel grow. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And if you want to be notified, click that bell button. That's it, man. I'm hella pissed. I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.